Ritz still there? Yeah. Well, that's my shirt, dude. And something. Alright. What was I doing? Oh, yeah. Almost killed myself. So I ran into a slight issue with what I'm building at my base. Mm -hmm. You don't have pancake. Well, yeah, there's that no, as well, okay. but you don't have pancakes. No. Nah. Fuck that, I ain't ever coming to your base. You got lots of jerky. No pancakes. Nah. Um, I don't want to get jerked off, I'm good. I didn't say jerk off, but... Alright. Um... Hey, 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 I want to, uh... Good. I was building a wharf. Or I was going to build a wharf near where my elevator is. But, um... When I go to build the, uh... Ceilings out to actually do the wharf when it's above the water it goes it that it's like it's too high to build so like from the bottom of the ocean the where I'm trying to build is too high so I think even if I had the uh, stone pillars coming up it would let me because uh, I put a stone pillar underneath like one of the ceilings that attached to um, land and it still wouldn't let me put it over top of the water bit. Yeah. So I'm gonna have to change the location of where the wharf is if I can find one that's um, gonna let me build on. Or you can build a wharf out of boats. Yeah, fuck that. I thought it was a genius idea. Uh, if you can get it parked properly without any issues. And then as long as no one goes and moves the boats on you. See, I'm the king well, of that's boats. That's why you block the ability to move it. What am I missing? Wood. Three of them tagged, waiting on the last two. It's gonna take a lot longer than the other one did because it's level 100. Damn. I'm still in love with my level 218 Argentavis. Yeah, I missed my 209. I mean, since it disappeared. It's like if you can get anything in the 200 mark, they're really good. Yeah. Yeah, rub it in.
Can you put T Rex arms on a trophy mount thing? No idea. I don't it think it's so. a trophy. Oh, maybe you can then. It says Tyrannosaurus arm. This trophy proves the worth as a hunter. And the same with the something vertebra. Yeah, the Bronto spine. Yeah. Uh, maybe you can then. I don't know. You'd have to give it a try. Well, anyway, I might then have a T Rex go because Raiders. Fuck for that shit. Nice. Yeah, but I don't have my Broodmother trophy anymore. Go kill another Broodmother. Yeah, not that easy. It is if you work as a team. We had to have modified server settings to be able to kill that thing and use rockets. I have faith that you can do it. With rockets and modified server settings, sure. <laughs> no, you just go over. Do you know here in America that Burger King's gonna start serving hot dogs? It wouldn't surprise me. Hot dogs are fucking good and Burger King makes good food. What weapon did you what weapon did you use to go against the broodmother? Rocket launcher. Yeah. Well, why'd you use rocket launchers? <laughs> because they do a dick ton of damage? <laughs> I was about to say because of the amount of damage they do. <laughs> Pose. I'll give you that one. Alright, time to go take blood from my blood bag. Which is a person I found laying on the sand. <laughs> His name is Jeff. Oh, Aww, poor Jeff. My name's Jeff. Her, na her name is Paul. My name's Jeff. <laughs> And it's okay because my name's Jeff. <laughs> looking for, I've got two jail cells and only one full, so I'm looking for another victim. That's another incentive for you two new guys to stay away. Uh, Wait, can they hear us? Yeah, they can hear if they're watching the stream while they play. That's Good incentive. I got both the. Boys? Uh, I got the um, my new setup again, like the device that was broken. I got the new one in the mail yesterday, so I was able to set up the stream the voice again. Are they girls or boys? I don't know. It's important stuff to know. Probably boys. Their characters are boys, so I would assume they're boys. All right, that's ten blood. Put into my fridge. Takes me up to 30 now. I feel so bad just, you know, having a guy locked him in a jail purely just so I can have his blood. <laughs> and then I feel like, you know, like that guy. I think I know where there is another person that you can get if they're still alive. Oh. I know where there's a few people on the map, it's just a long way to drag them. Yeah. Even though my dillo farm's coming along, I've got like 13 eggs so far, which isn't much, but in a day. And I've only been on half the time. Nice. <coughs> I don't know what kibble I can make with dodo eggs, I may just eat them.
see. Three, six, nine. Twenty one. Starting on my uh, dino, like my land dino pan. Okay, yep. I mean, you know, if Giggles would get on a freaking boat, I wouldn't need this, but. <laughs> Somehow that's not gonna happen. Oh yeah. We should no. get a T-Rex on a boat. I can get a T-Rex on a boat. That's what I said, at least you can get T-Rexes on a boat. Oh yeah. But uh, I'm just gonna have like small dinosaurs where my base is because I'm putting a wall down there, only about two, three high. And um Yeah. All my larger dinosaurs will be uh kept here for uh, so I can the use them when I need life. to yeah so I can use them when I need to and stuff so won't be an issue because once this wall's built up I can put everything that's there on aggressive and um, then I'll just eat anything that comes down there and if you know, that way they can't be dragged off into the water and to drown and shit. Yeah. Mm, that's good. But it's a bit foggy. Yeah. yeah I am anyway. Pretty dark where I am, and it's a little bit foggy too. Uh, hey look, I've almost got 20, uh, the 20 walls I need. You almost got 20 Don't followers? Walls, I said. Uh, I think it's the followers.
right there? Yeah, I'm just laughing. James asked where I was going to be putting this gig when I tame it. And uh, I just told him he's going to live in a nice giga sanctuary. You should have told him right outside your gate. <laughs> Unaggressive. He's like, do you know where my base is? I'm like, nope, you need to give me the coordinates so I can go tame this gear. Oh, my war's <laughs> complete. Like, are you leaving it outside my base or your base? And I'm like, well, if I'm keeping it, there's no way I'm leaving it near your base because it will eat you. Not if you put it on passive. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to put it on passive. Alright, Gigas are set to aggressive again. Mwahaha. <laughs> I hear there's no creature on Carl Island anymore. That's good. Yeah, no, I took him off there. I was gonna leave him there, but um, um, he was actually losing health from those stupid pike wars, or the spike wars. And so uh, I moved him away. In a little while, so I've been waiting a while so I could get on Carl Island to do some um. XP grinding, but I couldn't because of the damn Giga. Oh, well, if I know that. a Giga out there? Yeah, I had one of my Gigas out there. On aggressive no, wandering just around. Being random. <laughs> but, uh, I mean, if you told me, Ben, I would have moved him a long time ago. Well, it's <laughs> cool now. Oh, he wouldn't have. He would put another <laughs> one out there. He's like, oh, okay. oh, yeah, by the way, there is one there. No, it's not really. James is thinking that he's going to get a giga for just 5,000 cement in paste. I told him if he wants to, if he wants me to tame it for him, it's going to be expensive. And he's like, apparently thinks that 5,000 cement in paste is for him to keep it. And what is the 5,000 cement in paste for? Payment for me to spend my hours taming the damn thing. Damn it. Except you want it. Yeah. So that's got nothing to do with it. And then you get mad when somebody, like, attacks you. No, I'll tame something for someone. How accurate are these turret guns? Really like accurate. if someone was on a bird, would they be able to fly around and avoid the bullets? Or is it like, no. it spots you, you're dead? I killed James's pterodactyl. But not James? No, I killed James too, but it killed them both. Good. That's good. Now, did you just take off from my base? I'm literally just taking off now, yes. Oh, that's actually a wild one that I see that was right next to my base. Yeah, there was a there was two wild ones. One got killed by the dire wolf pack and the other one I don't know where that went. I've got one my like my wolf inside your fenced area at the moment, just because I need to finish my uh wall around my my base to keep it safe and secure. Can a T-Rex get through a a stone din dinosaur gate? Not the glass no. one, the just the stone one. No. It won't fit through that. Oh, oh, you wait. On. You I'm mean walking? Hold on. I thought you was talking.
talking about attacking. <gasps> if it's closed, no. <laughs> I guess I can start naming these. Yeah, I don't know, I might be finding a new job soon. Why is that? That one not going well or something? Well, I was talking to a guy and they used to work with us and he said he's getting like $29 an hour over there. Really? We're kind of slow, so it's like... <laughs> Plus... Uh... Alright, I'm back. So what were you saying about the gate, sorry? Um, are you talking about, uh, uh, like, it attacking to get through it? Like, destroy it? Or, that's like, just walking through it? Walking through it. Oh, okay. Yeah, the medium stone gate should walk through. Okay. If it's open. Well, yeah, if it's open. <laughs> really? Really? If it's open. Uh, I'm glad you, um. Clarified? I'm glad you verified that for me. <laughs> oh my goodness. James is now saying, oh, so to trade, will you take cement and paste the Narco Berries plus a lower level Giga? Like, really? I'm going to trade him a higher level Giga for a low level one? Well, he wants the one that fucked up your level 100 something. Well, that's only because it's a wild one. If it's, uh, when it's tamed, my, uh, my 97 would kill the damn thing. He doesn't know that, though. Uh, that's so funny. Uh. He reckons that if he wanted to eat gone, he would just kill it. I'd like to see him kill it. He reckons what? He reckons that if he if he just wanted it gone, he would kill it. Right. Sure. that he thinks you'd just be able to kill it. I'm like, dude, it killed a level 100 okay. Giga. Come on. Not before it caused you real mm. damage. Yeah, but it didn't eventually die. He would do mass damage, though. <laughs> like, mass, mass, mass damage. Sticking with my uh, rule of all Norse names for my wolves. <laughs> Have you got Loki? Boom, hold up. Yeah, Loki died already. Loki I, at Boom the time Hilda. I had one black wolf. So I named it Loki. You got had Boom Hilda. That like That's a Nordic one. Different. Then. Died. Did you put a gravestone up for your loss? I don't know how to make gravestones, dog. Uh, that's not good. James reckons he's got rockets. Yeah, I know 
gonna keep him for China. I've seen his base. Yeah. He's just trying to up talk you to keep you from going there. Yeah. Cause I can get rockets. I can make them right now. That's what I was saying to him, like, like how do you point. even have uh, rockets? Like you can't even craft them, you're not high enough level. God damn mammoth. Oh, but my homeboy, he uh, stuck a finger up my butt and I got him. <laughs> True story. Oh, wait, I wasn't supposed to tell you that. <laughs> <coughs> that gateway bullshit. Wait, what the fuck? Aha! Uh -huh. Well, I found Joker's freaking penguin. Sell it back to him. Yeah. Black market. He's been looking for the penguin. Did she stole it? Nope. He's got it on Wonder and it uh he <laughs> wandered off his island onto another little uh snow bit. Yeah, you can't put it on Wonder if you don't have walls. It was in his house, but as he was renovating, it uh, got away. Eight. I'll just sit it here so that he will see it when he comes back. He should be happy that he's got his uh, little penguin back. Why'd my bird poo on a boat? Jeez. Get ready for the commitment. Oh, those penguins. So, uh, he, re he chooses not to answer that question. What did you what? James, how he has rockets that he can't even craft them yet. Why is my mammoth moved? Did you move my mammoth? Nope. The mammoth shouldn't have moved. The direwolves moved to attack a uh, Ardatavis, unless the mammoth set to a uh, neutral or something. They don't pass me. I have no idea then. I didn't touch the mammoth. Are you sure? Yep. I am sure. Not doing little tips? Nope. Alright, I believe you. I'm gonna go tame a T-Rex. T-Rex! 
I like T-Rexes. Do you want a bionic oh, skin? Is it a... Sorry? No, Do I don't. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I think it's awesome. No, I don't like it. I don't like it. I'd rather... I prefer... I know there's a little low-level level 5 close to the swamp, so I might go after that. What level is the rocket launchers room? They're actually just before the turret gun. 60? Possibly? Nah, they would be higher level. than 60. I'll tell you. I don't remember. I'm looking now. I uh, didn't tell you if you already learned it. It's the same level as the turret gun. So you can get a rocket launcher before you can... The same level as the um, tranquilizer dart. I know that for a fact. So if you can make tranquilizer darts, you can make rocket launchers and the ammo for that. I believe it is about 65. Five seventy. You don't need to be particularly. It's not, you know, a max level weapon. No, nah, I just means. figured that it was uh, higher than level eighty to do it. Oh no, it's lower than eighty. So now there's ten dire wolves guarding the mammoth. Nice. I reckon that mammoth will be relatively safe. I'm probably going to need a fair bit of um, prime for this T Rex, aren't I? <coughs> yeah, if you want to do it quick. James is like, I just want a higher level Giga, but I don't want to actually tame it. It's like, whoa. He's like, name your price, anything. I should say 20 rocket launchers and 5,000 rockets. 100 million. See whether or not he says yes or no to it. What are you going to ask him for? That's what I'm saying. If he wants the gig, I should tell him, give me 20 rocket launchers and 5,000 rockets. You know how expensive they are? Yes, I do. That's why I said. <laughs> That's why I was saying. If he doesn't want to do the taming, but he wants to keep the gig, he should be paying out of his ass for it. Supply and demand, you know? Asshole. Yeah, well, it should bleed. It, sh <laughs> it should run red with the blood of our enemies. Filthy graphic. I love the fact that I can just farm with these dire wolves out here. <laughs> it's like, oh man, I need pelt. Oh, hey, look, 400 pelt.
By the way, your wolf got moved. So. Where is it? Postal in the tower. Yeah, I know it was trying to attack something. No. I actually moved it because I whistled all to follow the mammoth. Oh, and then yes. Went through and told him not to follow the mammoth. That's all good. I mean, you can set it to follow the mammoth. I don't mind. I just left it there temporarily because I was coming back to my base. I don't have the stuff to finish the wall yet, so I'm just leaving it where it's safe. Is it safe here? But he should be. <laughs> I think I might actually set my guns over here just to uh, players and tamed animal. Yeah. That's what I have mindset to. But it's also I'm like, well, sometimes the T-Rex will end up in this area.
yeah, my batteries are almost dead. <coughs> That's not very good. Nah. Especially as I'm flying. Is Ben? God damn! I hope I'm not too close. Well, you better be careful. I'm at that uh, the water bay just before the obelisk, the red obelisk. On, on the snow side or on the north side or the east side? Uh, heading down from the snow side, yeah. Yeah, that's my base. Huh. I'm pretty high up. I think I saw you. Alligator, they're killing turtles or something. Oh, I don't have an alligator. So, uh, yeah. if you can see animals, I'd say you're too low. No, you yeah. can see the animals before the buildings. Because I can't see a building down there in the water. Well, I don't have an alligator. I thought you had one. I thought Joker. What do you have? A frog and two birds. Oh, I thought. Joker said that you had an alligator underneath your base. <laughs> oh yeah, actually I did, but it it died. Oh. Yeah, you're right. I forgot about it. Didn't get air. Well, no, it was killed by piranhas. <laughs> of all fucking things. I couldn't see a building there, <laughs> so. Oop. Unless I'm on the wrong side. Just watch ten wolves run out and kill stuff. <laughs> Nice. This is so awesome. And I reckon you're fine. Got 133 rounds in that gun. You, you would have got your, um, you would have got a warning anyway, two second warning, if you were close. That's actually why my, uh, my guns right now are set to four second warnings. Why? Is because... Think two seconds is enough? Eh, I'd like to give my wolves a chance to kill the stuff before oh. it, uh... Because you like the sadistic path of letting other things mull her and destroy it first. Well, no, it's just mainly the the animals. Like, I don't want my gun to kill the animal, or the wolves do. Yeah. Like this fucking man is starting out. I think like level four. I haven't really rid him around or anything. He's already level ten. <laughs> nice. Just for being grouped up with the wolves. Yeah. And I'm guessing the wolves just kill any wildlife at all. Yep. I have them all set to neutral except for one who's on aggressive. And when that one goes and attacks, they all go and attack. I don't want to set them all to aggressive because then it creates issues. Yeah.
So are you gonna set your gigas to aggressive in here or not? They should be. Are they? They should already they're be. They just trained a T-Rex in there and they're just sitting there. Serious? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> like, yeah, they're just sitting there getting attacked. I don't know what they're doing. It's weird. I think Zao would be making a trip real quick. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, one of them's already dead. Weird. They're not being. Yeah, I figured you do. Mm -hmm. Maybe you just didn't care anymore. So are you going to make it to where they can't go up that ramp, or are you going to make it to where that ramp's walled off? There's going to be a um, gate there to stop it. Uh, they aggro to something below, man. They're just going to crawl them up the wall <laughs> and fall down. Well, they shouldn't. Nothing should uh, run up that way, so it should be all good. You'll have to show me your base later, Ben. Yeah. So that way I know how to write it. What? <laughs> no, that's Say not what? Why. That wasn't me that said that. Word! <laughs> hey, this thing's, uh, this thing's turreted up now. It's not going to be easy. Are they able to shoot, like, in the water? Yeah, they can. Because that's one thing I was wondering. I was like, well, able to hit through water and you can even put turrets under the water wait what oh that's gonna be nice so I wasn't my fourth turret will be going smack bang under my base that's in nice. the water for those who think they're gonna go from the underwater approach nice cuz I am fucking around I'm sick and tired of getting my shit raided yeah <laughs> The, um, this update's bringing out tribe alliances as well, so we'll have to make sure we do that. Oh, 
right, all right, all right. Safe to say, meat is not a problem for me anymore. Yep. It's not nice. okay, prime meat jerky lasts 199 days. I was about to say, it's, oh, yeah. it's nice when you uh, have a nice meat supply coming in again and uh, you start making it into jerky and stuff so you don't have to worry about food too much. Well, the main reason was it was just. I was sick and tired of every time I sign in, the spark powder or the oil had ran out and all my meat spoiled. Yeah. And I'd have to spend the first half an hour of the game going around getting meat cooking up just so I could carry on for the rest of the day with something. And now I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven stacks of jerky, one stack of prime, 300 bags of up. meat, uh, 300 bags of blood thanks to my prisoner. Guess I'm gonna have to move my mammoth. I also plan on putting a turret gun inside, like I plan on putting my t a turret gun inside my storeroom, so even if people do raid, there's a turret, I'm gonna put a turret gun next to my generator and a turret gun next to my storeroom. Yeah. But um, if they get past all of those turrets when they break into my wall and they get inside my house, they're just gonna get the shit blown up, blown away anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna be doing that as well as soon as I am. Um, I've done fucking around. As soon as I can make the extra turrets and stuff, I'm gonna be doing the same thing. Even if they get in, they're gonna be fucked by turrets. Like, nope. How many turrets you got? Four at the moment. They're not going to get into there because of the four turns that I do have. Um, but I'm going to put some extra ones inside of the storeroom just to be safe. Yeah. So apparently my wolves can uh, survive a really far fall. <laughs> fall. We tested it out, did we? Didn't mean to. I didn't mean to, but shit happened. I don't know how the fuck it happened. I came out and I had two wolves. I was like, what the fuck? And then I come around and I see some of them sitting down kind of where the gigas are. Yeah. And the other ones are even lower. But moving. Hold on. I even got my boat, my ark, I even plumbed it into, uh, like, I live above the water, but I have plumbing from the, the ocean bed up, so I don't actually have to, it's easier for me to get water. Yeah. Which I did for my boat when I, when you were able to glitch up and glitch it to the boat.
stupid thing. No, they thought to Talking to stupid trike. I gotta send them back. I just had to make like eight trips. <laughs> Yay, metal spawn back. <laughs> oh, I should have took all the metal that had on me off. Has stamina been changed? What do you mean? I don't know, I just, my dinos run like four steps and then their stamina's all gone. Weird, I don't know why. No. Only thing is, if you're attacking or doing like a special maneuver, it drains it. Yeah, that's what it. Yeah, you shouldn't be using up stamina at all at the moment with the current setting, unless you're attacking stuff. We're trying to pick that's stuff that's up. That's what I figured. Now, are you jumping? No, I was just running. Cool. I and mean, it might just be my still size. Yeah. It might just be my end. Like, I know with the Giggers, you can't sprint with them because they are. Uh... Well, you can, yeah. but, like, they use up their stamina really quick whilst sprinting still. Probably the same with the T Rexes, too, I imagine. Uh, yeah, probably. You yeah, boy. a nice couple <coughs> couple hundred cementing paste nice how many did I get let me see one two eighty can't complain the bugs just build up so quick it's so easy <laughs> so if you get the right spots yeah so on the map whereabouts are you like, I'm pretty sure I know the cove, but I didn't see your base there, but uh, I'll let you know when I'm heading back up, because uh, I'll get you to turn your yeah. turrets off so that I can have a close look. Yeah, that's cool. I'm just out getting some enterprise right this second. Hello, hello? Hello? Hey, sorry, my controller actually died. Let's go. Cool. So, um, I didn't Walking hear what you said, sorry. Frog. I said I almost just died on my frog. I had like a... Like a hundred out of the six hundred health left. Damn. 
So I got ambushed by a bunch of um, compies while I was killing at least six or seven. Well, probably more than six or seven bugs. Yeah, that's never but fun. But I survived. That's why I, I like doing it as a, in a team. Like Ted and I will go out and we'll do it. Um, yeah. Otherwise, it, get, it can get real dangerous real quick. Hmm. Well, I, I haven't actually needed to go into the swamp yet. I just go up into the hills, and it seems to work pretty good for me. Yeah, uh, as long as you don't over farm it. Otherwise, it uh, takes a bit to to spawn back, sort of thing. Yeah. Yeah, my base is roughly. If I was looking at that cove, roughly smack bang between the sixty and the seventy. Yeah, I was pretty sure I went over the cove, but I couldn't see a base. Maybe I was flying too high. Maybe. But I did see a crocodile in there. No, there are crocodiles in here naturally anyway. Yeah. So what you saw was probably just a wild one. <coughs> well, that was a nice, easy 800 cement and paste. Oh, sorry, not 800, 400. Because I can count. Help these guys tame. Well, I tamed it for them, and uh, a little trike to help them with gathering resources and stuff. Where's their base? Uh, it's down near the red obelisk, up the river a little bit near the swamp entrance a bit. Okay. I'll be keeping an eye on them. <laughs> Should be good. I got my supply of narcotics back up though, so I'm happy about that. Yeah, I need to start getting mine back up again because uh, I used about 600 to make trank arrows or trank darts for uh, this to try and knock out this giga and keep it down. I'm just waiting for freaking someone like Joker <coughs> or uh, Ted to get on to help me uh, tame it by getting me meat. Get it. Yeah.
have a boat? No, I've got two boats. Alright, cool. Because uh, when I come up, I'll get, like, I want uh, to have a look at your base. If you're not doing anything, we can come up and check out my base, but it'd be safer to take the boat. And then I'll uh, turn the turrets off when we get close. Yeah, it's fine. Rootmaster with the experience points up uh, a whole heap because this guy's already level 34. Mm, yeah, maybe. I was like, you'd set the back down.
I love the way the trikes look when they run. Back in two minutes. Alright, man. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Stupid.
Is my stream broken? What the fuck? So there we go, that's better. There it is. I'm back. Welcome back. Um, I forgot what the fuck I was making. Do you <laughs> want to turn those turrets off? <laughs> uh, I'm not there right this second, but when I get there... I oh, will. I see you. I can see where you are. You're right, right below me. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, we don't come any further over here at this second. Oh, I'm still high up in the sky. I thought your base was like further up, like closer to the rock. Um, but yeah, then that, that where it is now, like that did not spawn in when I was flying over originally. Well, just to let you know, I wouldn't come any closer because all three of my turrets are point were pointed at you. Really? Yep. So you were j just in range. Just out of range. <laughs> enough out for them. Of range. Yeah, long enough for them to um, far enough away right. for them not to shoot. It's but safe. Safe for you to come down now. Yeah. Right. I was about to say you got a uh, I got a Rex facing your base. <laughs> yeah, that's my boy. He collects food for me. <laughs> I like your bird just sticking its head out. Do you know why? That's why. <laughs> I don't have to go through the latch here to get to him. Because this just takes you down to the tree, the birdhouse. Yeah. You get a duck though. Once you get down. Because all the different shaped roots is a bit awkward. But yeah, that's all that's in here. Yeah, And then the latch yeah. below just takes you down to the ocean. Oh yeah, cool. I'll wait up in case you're falling. Yeah. Well, it was my original way into the base. Yeah. <laughs> Cut. So, oh, shit. Uh, I'll wait you out of the way. <laughs> oh, I slipped back in. There we go. There you go. <laughs> Um, in here. Wait, wait, I've got to look at this, I've got to look at this. At what? 
Where you going? You're a prisoner. Oh. I have to yeah. look at the prisoner. <laughs> Just wait. The next up, uh, not this update, but the next day, next update after that should include uh, handcuffs. This is just like the living bit bad yeah. smokers, I don't know what's, if anything, so one jerky, some stuff, but upstairs is, this up here is one of my storerooms. Yeah. Nice. All stone, so you know, they're going to have to hang around the base long for a fair while to attack it. Yeah. Oh, well, I mean, unless they use a idea. rocket from a distance, but then they're likely to blow that up anyway. So they're not, not much well, point. Well, I figured... I, my birds... It'll be hard for them to hit what they want from that beach over there, because of the distance. Yeah. But if they're at the beach where my T-Rex is, my guns could most definitely hit them anyway. Yeah. Well, that's what I'm saying, like, it would be hard for them to do, but that would be the only way to get in, like, your base, or I think yeah. it's by that, but... And if we go down, because I've got it at different levels, this is my crafting room. Wait, why is that a different colour stone? Is it because of the water so close? Yep, it's wet. I thought so. So, yeah, all my bits and bobs in here, this is where I make stuff. Cool. And the re there's a reason why you have to duck. It means people actually can't just run in and out quickly. Yeah. They actually have to duck to get in out. And then the basement. All the other Your generator sort of stuff. and uh, yeah, industrial. Yeah, have a look at what I've got at the moment. This is just over the last less than half a week. Yeah. I'm not going to take anything, I'm just talking. Blood packs. I pity they only last like 30 minutes though. No, 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 they don't, they last a day. This one is about to run out in 30 minutes. Yeah, yeah like what I'm Probably saying is that. like, that's a pity they like, they don't last longer sort of thing, like then it would be worthwhile for me to go and stockpile it a little bit more, but... Well, those 20, those 30 blood packs will last 30 days. One disintegrates a day. Yeah. It's the same as the meat. Um, and that's about it in here. We head out. Those ladders just take you up into the main house. They're the next to the fridges. Yeah. Dodos. And then over here, got my dodos and my dillos for eggs. Got a dodo egg. Mm-hmm. If you get a, um, just a little. I've got to do it myself later when I get my quetzals back in, if I can find the female one to tame. Um, if you get the, uh, what's it called, frickin' the oviraptor, um, yeah. and put it in next to the females, uh, it makes them lay eggs faster. A wild one or a tamed one? Both, but uh, I'll just tame it. I mean. Heck, I can lend, I will not lend you, I can give you freaking giga eggs so that it tames faster. Um, yeah. Because they love the large di dinosaur eggs. But um, why am I mm. not able to move right now? What the? Oh, there we go. There's electric. It's a bit glitchy. Um, and that's about it, my birdhouse. Cool. Um, I got a frog over here. Yeah. This is sorry. usually where, where I park birds on this roof for now. Yeah. Um, I'm going to put a couple of species X plants down here, just as a secondary defense. Yeah. But that's about it. That's my base for now. Looks good. I like it. You're going to have to uh, play in for a greenhouse. Yeah, that's easy enough. I just put some more stuff in the ground. Oh, shit. Uh, more um, pillars and just build up. That's the thing I like about this is I can build out as much as I want and I can have walkways going to different like sections. Yeah. Yeah, that no, would be good. I like it. Looks nice. Mm. Reminds me of Waterworld. And then that's what I was going for because I like living at the water. 
And then, yeah, I've got that boat, which is like, I call it my survival boat. Yeah. I can go and do a long, long expeditions where I might not get back to my base before I sign off so I can go inside the house and I'm fine. And then I've got this boat over here, which is like yours and Joe, because it's just a quick resource gathering boat. Yeah. Just a few chests, model and pesta, take it where I want, fill them up, fly, uh, sail back. Yeah, I've got, we've got two boats, um, at, like me and Ted. Cause it's pretty much me and Ted at the moment where I am. Um, yeah. One's gonna be turned into like a war boat, so we'll have weapons and shit like that on it. Um, but um, the other one is just a like that one there, just a craft like resource gathering, you know, for quick runs to go down, grab resources, and head back. We we'll use that when we come yeah. down to um, get cement in paste, because we come down the ocean along the river where the uh, red obelisk is, and up that way. To get to the um, yeah the uh, swamp, um, but yeah, when this update hits, though, we'll definitely have to heat up, meet up somewhere to do the tribe alliance because I'm hoping the tyrants won't kill each other. Then, um, just if we do get too close, you know, if we forget that the other one has a defense, you know, like your doors will still be locked for us and everything. But I'm hoping the tyrants will not target alliance to people. <laughs> I think it'll just have the option for you to set it like it's set, like it's at the moment it's aims at tamed and players or everything or just, you know, players or non-alliance. It'll have that option, I imagine. Yeah, that's what I'm hoping so I can set that up. Um, that way, like, you know, alliance can fly past but not, and not get killed but still not access the base sort of thing, you know what I mean? Yeah. But I'll fly I got my level 97 T-Rex over there, which is quite nice. Yeah, that is nice. I'm uh, flying away so you're like you can... like two uh, hits, um, Stegos. Nice. I've flown away so you can activate your turrets again, but uh, if you want to come up to my base, um, I'll, I'll show you, give you the grand tour. Yep. As long as I don't get shot. By roots. Uh, no, if you follow the edge of the, uh, the, uh, dome, like the whole, like the edge of the whole thing, um, where the barrier is, you won't get hit. Okay. I mean, you could technically yeah. go closer because he's got walls and stuff to stop them from shooting down that way. Because it's on a cliff face, so there's only one way through, like to it, or two ways, either by air or the main gate. So uh, he's got walls that stops it from shooting down in the water. So technically, you could go right next to the cliff face and not get shot, but for safety, I say go the long way, <laughs> a little bit longer away, sort yeah. of thing. But when we hit around where Joker's base is, which isn't too far from um, Root's place, <laughs> I think um, he's got turrets up now, hasn't he? No. I don't think he did. He was building a turret last night. Well, luckily though, that um, you'll be going around the back side of Joker's Island. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Just in case. But uh, I'll check that out real quick too. But if you start heading up that way, like yeah, as long as you follow like the edge of the map up. You'll be fine with in regards to turrets, and uh, I can turn mine off before it attacks you. Would it be safe for me just going to your old base, going to the inland way? No, because Roots got um. Uh, well, that's further away yet again. Um, I'm not too far from Roots and Joker's place, um, and you'd have to go okay. past Roots extended base which has turrets inland as well so you'll uh, yeah. get wiped out by those but um I mean if you, as long as you're following the barrier you'll uh, get to my base really really quickly and easily because um it's in the snow bio out in the ocean so you're not going to be able to get to via land anyway Turn my stream off now. There's uh, no one's watching. Oh no, hang on, there are people watching. Oh, never mind. I'll leave it going for a while. Hey, who's 
boat's that? Oh, that's that random. I'm on a random's boat in the middle of the ocean, right next to the um, barrier, so I'll wait here for you. Cool. I'm gonna tame a megalodon soon. We've, oh, I actually better check those. I've got, uh, thanks to Ted, we've got two sharks now as well. I need to get a few more sharks tamed. Yeah. Because I'm gonna make some saddles for ours. I feel like two of ours. Because like I said, it's me and Ted that live there, so I need two saddles for them. But, um, I'll, um, get two saddles, but then I want at least three to follow each one that we're using to ride mm -hmm. on, just for that extra little protection on them sort of thing. Because um, I've got two full sets of Scooby gear made, one for Ted, one for me, and then I've got two extra tanks, one for each person, just in case we're underwater for a long period of time. Um, yeah. And uh, I made a set for Joker and Ruth as well, with extra, one extra tank for each of those as well. So they've uh, they've got some Scooby gear going too now. Well, I, I, I've I've just gone past Ruth and Joker's. Uh, are you following the um? Ah, fuck! What the hell? Are you following the uh bar barrier? Yeah. What the? I didn't even see you go by. Alright, wait there near Jokers. What the hell? I was on a Thatcher boat that was just sitting there right near the barrier. Alright, hang on. I'm flying up towards uh, Jokers. That's Roots. I think that's Joker's there, actually. Ah, let me know if you see me. Wait, oh, you're flying? Yeah. Oh, that's why I thought you were taking your boat. Ha! No. Alright, there we go. Did you see me? Uh, yep, I see. Her. This is Jokers. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, if you'll wait here on this iceberg here, mm -hmm. that's just in front of me, I'll go get my turrets turned off. But uh, I want to give you the grand tour, which starts down the bottom, so don't fly straight up to the top. <laughs> Of this iceberg, or is it somewhere else? No, no, this one I want you to wait at just so that my because my turrets are set for a long range, I don't want you to accidentally get shot down by them. So, um, I'm sitting on top of it, so yeah, yeah, you can sit on top of it, that's fine. That's just because it's that one I know is you know at definitely a safe distance from my turrets, so. I just don't want you to get shot down by the turrets before I get to turn them off. And you still need to put my uh, keypad so I can just put the pin code in to turn them on and off. Once I get to your base, I'll have to jump inside just to replenish my health because it's cold here. Oh, that's right, you don't have fur, do you? Damn. Nah, uh, chitin. Oh my god, fucking bird. Land. Thank you. One, two, three, four. Alright, do you see which way I started flying? Yep. Alright, start heading over that way.
there's actually a building down the bottom that you can uh, go into to get some uh, your health replenished. Alright, where are you? There you are. Down here. Can you lead the way? So you can see the wall I've started to build down the bottom for uh, our dinos. Yeah. Oh crap, what the hell? Wow, the lag. That's the first time I've ever gotten it here. Actually, I don't know if this will replenish your health because... Um, the whole no, it's still cold in here. What's your health at? Oh. 216 out of 360. Okay. It'll be fine until we get up to an actual enclosed area. Yeah, it won't take long. This took freaking forever. It's over 30 tracks for that, dude. I bet it would take a while. Even though we could just fly up there, but you know. Oh, what the hell? So I'll move. Nah, it's all good. I don't know what the hell was going on. Yeah, we could fly up, but. Grand tour starts from down the bottom, so you know. Once um, I had the this elevator done and powered up, doing these pillars was so easy, dude. I just stood on each corner and just placed as it was going up. Yeah. There's some oddly placed pills. The bottom ones up there? Yeah, see... To get the floor to around the same level as this, I had to do that second layer, this one right here, that we're on. So I can't remove these yeah. pillars or this whole floor freaking falls. i just leave my bird here, I guess. Yeah, you can leave your bird there. I'm just walking mine outside into the sun. Apparently it will not let me jump off my bird. Oh, you may have been trying to activate the uh, elevator. Yeah, there you go. Alright, next. So that's the uh, elevator bit. This is our little fort. Uh, <coughs> actually, fuck. Just uh, wait out here for a second, I need to check something. One sec. Yep, I thought so. Things want to try and kill me. Yeah, they should all have all been on passive to start with, but I just whistled them all on passive, so it should be fine now. Let me just do a quick check. Passive, 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 yep. Alright. Sorry about that. I thought they were already on passive. So we've got some wolves, a frog. Let me just close this. Two frogs. There's a aircon right here if you need it. Got a couple of penguins. <laughs> it should be warming up now, hopefully. Yeah. There are sounds still cold, but I'm not freezing. Yeah. Yeah, as long as you're not freezing, you should be alright. You should be getting health back. But, uh, <coughs> in here. Is the kitchen? Oh, yeah. Lots of jerky bins. And look, I've even got water. You have water? Yep. Oh, yeah. Running water. So you got your jerky stash back up? 
Yeah, it's taken me a while. Your egg stash is going pretty good. Yep. See how many giga eggs I've got though? <laughs> like, fucking 14 of them. Mm. They weigh a freaking ton, dude. Oh my, what the? Mm. Oh, there you are. Um, this is my generator at the moment in here, in this room. Oh, yep. <laughs> and then, up, like, you, this takes us up to the second floor, but there's also another way up, which I'll take you instead. But that also takes us, because we're in one of the towers right now, and that also takes us up to the turret placement that's up on that tower. But, uh, this is the second floor, there's nothing up here yet. Um, Ted's ha uh, bedroom will be on this floor somewhere. Um, and then we're gonna furniture and stuff. Up here is not finished either, but up here will be where my bedroom goes. Um, eventually, once I finish doing other more important stuff. <laughs> yeah. And then. What the hell? Just walked on something. Um, but yeah, the, then there's like. There's two different ways for each tower to get into, so. These animals aren't staying there, like the land creatures will go downstairs eventually and uh, when I get the uh, bird cage built, they'll be getting stored there as well. This is obviously the storeroom. No, uh, yeah. So I've got my coal generators here, behind you. <laughs> Got six of those. Generators. Oh, okay. Yeah, for ammo and stuff. Um, I got my.